Thank you very much. Thank you, Caroline, for your kind words, also concerning my predecessor. We worked together with UNOF on preparing uh, this building, having it ready for this important conference every year, so uh, we share your thanks in this regard. Mr. President of the National Council, uh, Royal Highness, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Estel, it is a great pleasure for me to participate again in this year's Zero Project Conference. And I thank the Essel Foundation profoundly for the opportunity to say a few words to all of you at the opening of this important event. Already last year, more than 700 participants from more than 83 countries came to join this conference. And this year, we reached the same level. The conference promises, due to its very interesting program on innovative practices and policies on education, an excellent exchange of information during the sessions, as well as during the impressive site program. Representing the host country, let me say a few words about our national position. Austria is a member of the United Nations Human Rights Council, and this is currently chaired by an Austrian. Austria strongly promotes the rights of persons with disabilities. We have ratified the relevant UN Convention 2008, and the recently sworn in government very clearly commits to its implementation. The government states in its program the clear will to follow an inclusive approach. Specific attention will be paid to the education of children with special requirements. The government is committed to increase the offer of inclusive education in schools, but also in the tertiary sector. Other commitments concern the inclusion in the labor market or the inclusion through sports. Recently, on the 24th of January, the International Day of Education, education was celebrated here. We had a conference in the VSC organized by UNODC on the role of higher education in strengthening the rule of law worldwide and in achieving SDG 16. The Austrian delegation pointed out the importance of inclusive education and informed the participants about this private initiative, the Zero Project Conference. To everybody who is working in this field, it is clear that the contribution of the civil society to bring about improvements is highly important. I commend you all on your dedication, your daily work, but also your readiness to come here and share experiences which will lead to new networks and new ideas and maybe even new projects. In this context, I want to thank Mr. Essel very much for his initiative and actions about which he just informed us, and it's incredible what is going on <laughs> through Zero Project, um, for providing also this excellent platform. I thank you for your attention, and I wish all of us an interesting, informative, and very successful Zero Project Conference 2020. Thank you.